Thank you for your interest in Modular Framing Systems aluminum framing products. In this video, we'll go through the different size frames and explain the part number nomenclature as it relates to selecting the correct frame for your application. Our framing systems are comprised of a series of aluminum die cast components and corresponding aluminum profiles. We have two styles of frame. Our standard frame features a 90 degree external edge and our blunted material features a chamfered external edge. The standard and blunted frames function exactly the same, they're just aesthetically different. Each size system has four basic components, a corner, perimeter profile, omega joint, and omega profiles. Now the primary driving factor of frame selection is the desired wall or insulation thickness of a unit. We have systems designed for wall thicknesses from a nominal half inch up to a full two inch. I use the term nominal because the system was developed in metric measurements and we typically discuss them in standard measurements here in the states. So let's go through each system starting with our smallest first. The 12010 system is designed for a 10 millimeter wall thickness which is just shy of a half inch. Part numbers for this system are A23010 and P12010. The A prefix signifies it's a corner or angle or angolo in Italian. The P prefix signifies profile or profilo in Italian. The numbers in each part number are indicators of the physical dimensions in millimeters for each component. But to simplify the discussion, we'll only break down the numbers on the profiles. In part number P120-10, the 20 is the millimeter dimension on the face of the profile. This is the exposed surface of the frame that you see if you're using panels. The dash 10 indicates the maximum panel thickness. So looking at a corner joined with the profile, you have 20 millimeters here and 10 millimeters here. This information helps you determine size and thickness of your panels or insulation. Taking that logic, let's move to the 12018 system, which has parts A23018, P12018, and P22018. In part number P12018, the 20 is the face and 18 is the designed wall thickness. With the addition of part number P22018, we can look at 120 versus 220. The 120 indicates that the part is a perimeter profile with a 20 millimeter face and the 220 indicates that it's an omega profile with a 20 millimeter face. The 100 versus 200 part ID is generally going to be the case with every system with certain variations. Our 13025 system has part numbers A33025, P13025, GOP23125, and P23125. Using our explanation of coding, this system is designed with profiles that have a 30 millimeter face and facilitate a wall thickness of 25 millimeters or a nominal one inch. The addition of the GOP was a game changer for the full product line. GOP is a term we use for our omega joints. The acronym stems from the Italian word giunzione, or joint. When the system was originally developed, it began with a corner and profiles. The intermediate supports were designed with a bolt track to allow them to be attached to the perimeter frame by notching the flanges on the Omega and using a bolt, nut, and washer to secure the intermediates in place. That process is labor intensive and time consuming, which translates to cost. The GOP was developed to streamline things and of course save time and money. Now nearly every system has a GOP. Moving along to the remaining systems, for 25 millimeter or one inch wall thickness, in addition to our 13025 system, we have the 14025 system and 15025 system. The 14025 system is for a 40 millimeter face with a 25 millimeter wall thickness, and the 5025 is a 50 millimeter face for the 25 millimeter wall thickness. For 45 millimeter or 1.75 inch wall thickness, 
we have a 150-45 system. For our nominal 2 inch or 50 millimeters, we have the 170-50 system, which is 70 millimeter face for a 50 millimeter wall thickness. The 130, 140, 150, and 170 systems are available in our blunted series, and the Omegas are available with or without a bolt track. Please contact us for a quotation or with any additional questions you may have, and we'll be happy to assist you. We can be reached by phone at 713-538-2050, or you can contact us through our website at modularframing.com. For more product videos on our other products, you can check out our videos page at modularframing.com or click on the YouTube icon at the top right hand side of our website to go to our YouTube channel. Thank you again for your time and interest.